triangle swimsuit review. Hey guys, it's Danielle here once again. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for the nice comments, you guys. I'm so excited to bring to you another video to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be doing a review as I'm doing a swimsuit review on triangle swimsuits. That's right, you guys. And this is going to be the big girl friendly, the curvy girl triangle swimsuit review. You too can wear what you want. You too can wear a teeny weeny itsy bitty bikini. I do see a lot of reviews on triangle swimsuits. Obviously they are a very, very popular swimsuit brand, but do you ever see anyone pass a size four? I do see, you know, the bigger breasted girls trying to give their take on it and those, you know, weird sizing issues, but that's not even my concern. My concern is the curvy girl, the big girl, okay? There are so many things that we can do, so many angles that we can get those shots. Like, listen, you can wear the teeny tiny string bikini, and I'm about to show you how. Triangle is a Australian swimsuit brand. That already there tells you these bathing suits are gonna be teeny. Their factories, where they ship from, is actually in China. That's another thing we're going to get into in this video. We're going to get into shipping and when you get your stuff, how fast you get your stuff, and shipping costs. Now, Triangle is very popular for their neoprene bikinis. Now, what is neoprene? I don't know. Maybe what you wear to sweat your ass off in the gym. This is a neoprene workout suit that I will wear to sweat it all off. When I'm working out, you know, you might use neoprene to sweat. Neoprene is also the fabric that wetsuits, diving suits, that's what they're made out of. And that is what Triangle Swimwear is known for. They kind of have like the bustier look to them and a lot of color blocking in them. As you may have seen them circulating around, but for the past mm, two or three years, those Triangle Swimsuits have been very popular around the internet. But recently, Miss Courtney K. Kourtney Kardashian has made these ones, this little velvet swimsuit. Kourtney Kardashian has made these itty bitty velvet bikinis very popular in one of her recent Mexico vacations on the beach. So that might be another way that you're familiar with the triangle or with the triangle velvet bikini. But specifically, yes, I am talking about the Annabelle. Is it anime? I think this is called the Annabelle, which is this specific bikini cut in this specific color. I do believe it is the Annabelle on the Triangle website. Annalise! Annalise! Velvet Triangle String Bikini. Well, like I said, I have not found a lot of bigger girls who have shown these swimsuits. So, you know, I had to bring it to you with the realness of a girl who is like me. A little cur curvy. All triangle swimsuits do come in their own little carry packaging. These ones here and probably anything that is not actually made of neoprene material probably will all come in a little zippy bikini pouch. But you know, you can convert this to like a makeup bag or keep your bikinis or beach slash pool wear in here if you want to, just whatever you want to do with it. It did make it convenient for carrying it back home on the plane. After, you know, it's wet and then you may, I leave my swimsuits after um, I get in from the pool or the beach, I leave them kind of like in the shower. So they're kind of always getting watered down. So this um, swimsuit bag actually did come in handy to kind of like separate the dampness and the moisture from the rest of my luggage. So points for them with the um, bikini bags. That's awesome. So it's just like a little added bonus. Yes, they do tell you in the description, but who reads descriptions when you see a bright pink velvet bikini? Come on, you're buying it. And let's start off with sizing. Very important, right? Sizing. The triangle goes from extra small to extra large. So even though I am making a Curvy Girl Friendly Triangle Bikini Review, it is important that I note that extra large is the biggest that they go. And it ain't that big. <laughs> so this is the extra large top here. Yeah, this is it. This 
This is extra large. So extra large <laughs> is about that big. This is stretchy, but anything over a C cup, get an extra large. You might not even be a curvy girl. Like I like a swimsuit bikini top to be kind of like cutesy and kind of small anyway. So I just want to tell you, if you're anything <laughs> from a medium and up regularly, get a large. And if you normally would get a large, get an extra large when it comes to triangle bikinis. At least on the top, you do what you want on the bottom. We're going to talk about that in a minute. I'm not going to give you exact specs because that's just not me. I'll go ahead and do a little try on portion of this video. Very, very stretchy. So yeah, that's the extra large, guys extra large you get my drift like go a size up go a size up okay this is the extra large and this is over a bra and over a t-shirt but this is the extra large not a lot of coverage not a lot of coverage but then again it's a bikini like come on we're out here trying to get a little sun on the skin you got all the vitamin d we can get not a problem for me and I don't really think it should be a problem for you either. if you're worried about support it is a string bikini you're not getting any sort of supportive factor as far as cupping or wireage or padding or lining no this is you know thin it's like a little velour <laughs> texture that's not what you're getting with this you're not getting covers with this you're getting style you're getting a velvet pink pasty situation but the thing with string bikinis is that you can kind of tie and pull to get the coverage that you desire for me with string bikinis I always do them very tight as you can see here this is the length that I've had on this bikini the whole time I wore it and I've left it on there I do that a lot with bikinis that just don't untie them you just leave them because like that's where you know you want your support level at now I say support level with a grain of salt, but you get what I'm saying. That's how tight you want your straps. All right, I untie this because you know, it's not gonna really affect your support. Even though you're not getting any support added into this, the support factor is always determined by you with a string bikini based on how tight you wanna pull these. Hoist them up in there, you know, fill up that cup, hoist them up in there, tie your band really tight so there's nowhere for them to go down and Tie that thing on tight around your neck, okay? You see mine very tight because these bands are super stretchy. Super stretchy on the strings, okay? And that brings me to my next point. Now these are, like I said, made out of, it is Italian velvet, okay? Italian velvet. The velvet material on the strings is actually kind of delicate. And I do believe like after a while, these can wear down. Like with this, I don't know if you've ever had a string bikini um, situation where you've tied it and this right here, unless I really like go to work with like some toolage and really try and get up in there, I'm not gonna be able to get this tie out. Like it, it's in there. Now that this is tied and has been under the pressure of being behind my neck with the weight of my breasts, <laughs> I ain't never getting this out because this specific string and this material once it kind of locks together it's not coming out and it does seem like after a while it's going to be kind of delicate so that's that now let's move on to the bottoms the top was definitely teeny weeny <laughs> and then i pulled out the bottoms and i was like <gasps> for me this is the extra large this is for a bigger girl. This is for me. Thighs, hips, chunk -a I got all that. So this was definitely a very teeny tiny bikini. Doesn't look like I have as many issues on the strings at the bottom here. Obviously it's fully adjustable, fully, you know, untieable. You know, just a regular string bikini. That's the back of an extra large. That is all your coverage. Even though I do find them to be a little teeny tiny and sparse as far as material goes, you know, as with any string bikini, you get these super, super long strings. So it's definitely self 
adjustable, totally customizable to how you want to wear it. You know, you can make this, you can make the strings long so you can do that, you know, 90s thing and make, you know, give yourself a super high waist if you want to. You could wear it low and tight. And even if you tie these as tight as they can be and make this bikini, you know, like this small, it looks kind of tiny for me. It stretches out even if you want them super close to you and you don't want any of that like string line, if you know what I'm saying. You can make them super tight and this is going to stretch out to you. I'm not worried too much about the bottoms. Yes, they are teeny weeny, but it is totally customizable, like I said, and it's a swimsuit. You know, at some point, I want all the big girls to realize, like, we're at the pool, we're in the beach, <sighs> let it go. This is a place where you can be like, you know what, I'm not going to worry about it here. There are so many cute little sarongs, cute little shorts, even things that you can wear with your swimsuit into the water. You know what I'm saying? So don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Not this year, okay? Not 2017. Wear what you want to wear. Be who you want to be. Look how you want to look, okay? That is just my thoughts on this teeny wee, tiny little bottom. I did it. You can do it too. Oh, so let's go into a little bit about this material. Fancy Italian velvet. I never really read too many of the instructional facts on this, but you know, why not now? Hand wash in cold water, dry in the shade, or iron inside out, interesting. After, you know, coming back from my bag, being on the plane and like crunched up in the luggage inside of here, I kind of just balled it up and put it, you know, on the side of my luggage where I needed it. Like you come back and it's like, no, <laughs> it's not crushed velvet. You know, it does take on some wrinkles. So I think that's very interesting that they are letting you know, you know, you can iron it if you want to. I think if I laid it flat, it'll probably come back to the um, shape that I need it to on top of the fact that it's tiny. So I'm going to put it on and the wrinkles will stretch out anyway. It is just a swimsuit. Iron inside out. Obviously don't iron on the velvet side. Do not spin dry. Do not bleach. Who's bleaching this hot pink color? Clean. Avoid rough surfaces and store flat. Do not fold. That makes a lot of sense. You can definitely see every fold that lasts for a long time in the velvet. And most of their products are neoprene. So if you fold neoprene, that fold is kind of going to stick there for a while. Extra large, like I told you, and triangle. That's pretty much that for that, but um, I will definitely be inserting some pictures of me wearing this bikini, enjoying this bikini, so you can see that yes, a girl like me, who is a size 10, 12, 14, if I want to be nice and comfy and not tight, that size range can definitely wear a triangle bikini, you know, like get yourself what you want, do what you want be who you want, and I just encourage everyone to, you know, wear what they want to. If you're not going to do it anywhere else in life, at least do it to the beach, okay? At least do it to the pool. Do it when you're having a good time, you're on vacation, and you're trying to relax, okay? So, that is my review on the triangle velvet bikini. Now, I do want to say that I'm also very interested in their other um, velvet bikinis. I've never really been into their neoprene swimwear. It's not my style. I know that it is a lot of people's styles. I know that when Victoria's Secret had swimwear, I know that they did copy a lot of those um, styles, a lot of those triangle styles of bikinis. So now that Victoria's Secret is not selling swimwear anymore and you were ever interested in those neoprene color blocked um, bustier looking swimwear they copied it from triangle so you can still find it on triangle i also want to say that triangle does have you know like a wide range of styles but they are kind of all geared to the teeny weeny bikini range like you're not gonna find too much as far as coverage with them they do have a few one piece swimsuits that are really cute um the velvet one piece is so cute not for me but it is so adorable and honestly i think that would be so cute on like a smaller girl who is pregnant that velvet triangle one piece that would be so cute on you girl they have like some high cut briefs with you know like the athletic um 
the athletic sports bra style tops. They have a few other options. They're, you know, like I said, most famous for those neoprene swimsuits and like either just, it's like a non-adjustable triangle style or the bralette, you know, like bustier style. That's, you know, what they're most known for and what a lot of their swimsuits come in that are away from the velvet line. Like I said, this velvet line is brand spanking new, made popular by Kourtney Kardashian, made popular by me. I don't know if you saw it on my Instagram. <laughs> no, I'm totally just kidding. Don't. Don't do that. I already went over the sizing, like I said, extra small to extra large. Size up on all of that. Their sizing is like geared towards Australian women. I'm just gonna come to the conclusion that they're just a lot smaller than us. Now I'm not taking, you know, a stab in the dark on that. Like obviously we know you go to Europe, you go overseas in general, like, you know, American, we're kind of a little more indulgent. We're a little bit bigger. It just is what it is. <laughs> so the sizing is definitely geared towards a European, Australian woman and not the American woman. And next on to pricing. So pricing for these for these bikinis. Pricing, I'm honestly going to tell you, as far as high-end swimwear, I actually think the pricing of these are great. Like $89 for a swimsuit that is this like vibrant. So like in a popular velvet for right now, $89. The only thing that I have to tell you is that after sizing and styling and pricing, then there is shipping. So like I told you, they are an Australian based swimsuit company that ships all of their stuff from China. This stuff comes too fast, I will tell you that much. But you have no choice but to pay $20 for express shipping. Yes. No matter what, no matter where you are in the world, I mean, at least no matter where you are in North America. I can only tell you from, you know, the site that I search from. But yeah, you have no choice but to get express shipping. Like I told you, paying $89 for this, this, and this, to me, is a pretty fair deal but you do have to pay for the shipping so then these triangle bi bikinis do become hundred dollar bikinis basically i know that's nothing new if you shop for swimwear if you do shop on victoria's secret for swimwear if you do shop l space or you know swimwear can be expensive a uh, hundred dollar swimwear can kind of be a normal thing but if you shop at Target for your swimwear, if you shop online and get great deals for swimwear, a hundred dollar swimwear might make you feel like, oh. Like I was so excited. I was like, yes, the swimsuit I want and it's even the brand that's popular. Yes, it's $89, yes. And then adding that $20 to make it a hundred dollar swimsuit then made it okay, like yeah, okay, click, put it in my cart. You know, I expected triangle swimwear to be $100 swimwear. I just was so excited when it wasn't and when it was only $80. I was kind of let down because I thought I was like, oh my God, something I really wanted and a brand that I, you know, really have seen so much of is $89, it's perfect. But that leads me to my next point, which is shipping. What do you think about express shipping? Because you know, you get a lot of clothes and, you know, things here and there from China and you know, uh, is this going to get to me? Am I going to get this six months later and not even remember what the hell I bought? But I just want to let you know that that mandatory $20 express shipping is kind of worth it because this swimwear comes to you so fast. Believe it or not, okay, so that $20 got me this swimsuit in two days. And the triangle swimsuit got to my location, my end destination in two days. I had this shipped to my best friend's house in Florida because I was going on vacation. We were going to Miami, so I'm having it shipped to her house in the case that if I ship it here to Michigan, 
It might not get there till the day I'm leaving. It might not get there till after I left. It tells you that it's going to take three to five days. No, honey. It got there on Wednesday. Now they do FedEx these. You do have to be there. You have to sign for your triangle somewhere. Their stuff gets here in a flash fast than anything. Like I'm just trying to tell you, this actually got there too soon. No one was home, ordered on Monday. It got there on Wednesday. So my girl had to, you know, just sign the little FedEx slip and then the rest of my friends showed up. My girl wasn't home yet, but the rest of my friends showed up to um showed up to her house and they were able to, you know, get the package for me, bring it in from outside and the package was there waiting for me when I got there Thursday. So shipping on this is basically amazing. Like it was a twenty dollars well spent. I wish it wasn't $20, I would have waited a day or two more for it to have been, I don't know, $10, maybe even $15, like goodness, but it worked out. I have a feeling maybe, it just can't be, this could have came from China in two days like that, could it? If you want to return your um, items, you have to send it registered mail and send it back to them to somewhere, it's either Indiana or Illinois. So I'm like... Was this in one of their facilities in Indiana or Illinois and then they just sent it to Florida because how? No, I got to wear it and I will show you the pictures to prove it. Okay, so in lieu of me, you know, standing up right here and giving you a try on, I am just going to insert pictures of me wearing it. I know, I'm sorry. I'm just not about to stand up here and like model a swimsuit for you right now. It's not gonna happen today. I'm sorry. Um, not because I'm ashamed of my body, but it's just like, <sighs> do I really wanna put a swimsuit on right now? No. And that's a whole lot of lotioning and greasing. Cause I would want it, for you, I want it to be fabulous. You know, if I was gonna do that, it was gonna be fabulous. I was gonna have the shimmer gel all up over the body and everything, but you know, I'm not doing that. Sorry. <laughs> But I'm definitely going to be inserting clips of me wearing a swimsuit and then you can see that you too or me too or us too curvy girls can wear triangle swimwear. And that's the whole one of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you got some information. I hope you understand that these swimsuits are great value. I do recommend them and that you can wear them at any size. So triangle. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all these comments and subscriptions and thank you.